Hello friends, welcome back to the new video of React Native. So today we are going to learn about the React Native Razor Point Razor Pay integration in React Native. So how we are going to do it? Let's get started. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel and hit like to this video. Okay, so let's get started. So first of all, we are going to make a fresh project installation for this. Okay, so this is Razor Pay we are going to add. So let's create a new project terminal paste razor pay razor pay integration okay <coughs> this will create a new project So it's installing. So let's move to the Razor pay this and we have to install the one of the package react native razor pay okay npm i this is installed <coughs> okay let's go to the documentation so here we have the documentation of it so control this is a sample app they have made so let's add this one and see where we have where we have react browser pay in it app.js so control a control v we have to create a account for this also okay so let's go and check the account creation So here we have to enter our mobile number or sign in with Google. So I'm going to use my Google account. What is business type? Not yet un un unregistered. Okay. Then we have to add our contact details here. So I'm going to create account. Dark number. No, I don't want it. Okay, so let's next. So this is the dashboard. Okay. It's coming. Let's go for go for the test accounts. Okay, this is the test mode currently. Now we have to create a. <coughs> create a test key which is required over here. So let's see to generate the APIs in the test mode. <coughs> Log into dashboard, select test mode for which you want to generate test mode live code, then settings API keys settings. Let's go for the settings. <coughs> settings. Uh, API keys. Okay. Generate API key. So this is the our test key ID. So I'm going to add it over here. So here we are with go with the what they are asking for. Key. We need the key. So what is your API key? So it is the key that I'm going to add it over here. This is my test key. Okay. So I have added this one. 
okay let's create a build and let me add one more thing that is pending over here that is local or properties i need to add it into the react browser page and draw it and paste okay paste done let's create a build so let's create the build and let's see Open the another tab for the pure running. <coughs> now build is installed. Okay, you can see that here. Uh, let me uh, connect to the any disk. And here we go with this one. So accept start now. Okay, so hey, uh, so sorry, this is not that one. So we, uh, I think we should go with this one. Reload. This is the Razer Pay. Okay, you can see that here. Pay with Razer Pay. When I click on this Pay with Razer Pay, SDK should be opened. Okay, so here is the payment gateway for that. So this is basically a test account. Okay, and we have all the functions over here. Right, I can make the payment of like you can see that anything that you want to have over add it over here let's do pay later option is there you can see that all the options are there i will make it like one rupee over here and let's see what's happening over here so let's let me add the where we have the razor pay app.js so where we have the payment of amount 5000 it is written but it comes to be this let's make it one okay let me cross this SDK and you can see that here it says that bad request okay so I'm going to pay with Razer pay again it should be one it should be ten okay I'm, I need to minimize it to one also so let me add one more okay so let's go back then pay with the let me reload this app okay pay with browser pay so this is one so I will select any of the phone pay I think it is in the uh, test mode so I think it is not working go back so you can see that success this one part payment has been done let me check over here download the keys okay cancel it okay okay and let's see the dashboard transactions and you can see that one rupee transaction is there authorized right this is the payment of one that I have done right now 
so this is how we can do uh, if you go with the live that live test account so definitely they are going to pay you for deduct money from your account right so this is how we can integrate the razor pay so this is well inbuilt okay so any query any just you need to add here we have added the button okay with the var options and all and after that we have a razor pay dot checkout then we have alert whether it is payment id is done or not then you can print the whole data what exactly they are getting on and what is the error code that they have on the behalf of it you are going to redirect to the back screen home screen or whatever you can do that one right so this is how we can do the razor pay integration in react native so any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day